Hi, I think I've started recording. So hello, good to see you guys. Um, happy Monday period one. I hope you guys are doing okay. I hope you're getting outside and like feeling the sun and breathing the fresh air and not sitting in your room in your pajamas all day long. Don't do it, don't do it. Um, I wanted to make a video because I haven't seen your faces and um, you haven't seen my face. And I think it's important to actually like visually see somebody during this time. So I just kind of wanted to give you a rundown of what's going on for this week. Uh, we've got uh, to finish up our um, hyperbolas um, and we're going to do a review now. So the review is going to be knowing which equation matches which shape, right? Which diagram. And so it all depends on whether there's a plus sign in the middle, whether there's a minus sign in the middle, um, what it equals, if it equals one or if it equals a radius, right? So those are the kinds of things we're going to look for. And your assessment, your quiz, your test for this chapter, conic sections, is going to be make up your own equation for a circle, make up your own equation for an ellipse, make up your own equation for a parabola, and make up your own equation for a hyperbola. And it's going to be kind of like we did last time, where I'm going to create a Google document and I'm going to say, like, number one, write your own equation for a circle and then draw a picture. So your, your picture can either be using Kami, where you write on it. Um, some of you posted um, actual pictures of you, like, on a separate sheet of paper, drawing a picture of it. Um, and so we'll do that. If any of you have suggestions about the best way to draw a parabola, hyperbola, circle on the actual Google Doc that I have for you, I would love to hear that in the comments below because other people might want to know as well. So that's going to be your test. That's how I'm going to assess you. I'm not going to give you something on GoFormative. It's going to be make up your own, and then that way everybody will have a different, uh, different, you know, focus, different, everything, everything will be different for all of you guys. Okay. So that is it. Um, keep checking in as far as attendance every day. And I want you to just try your best and reach out. I haven't heard much when you guys have questions, you aren't asking me for help. So I'd encourage you to do that as well. Um, and yeah, that is it. You can expect your test on this chapter to be, I think on Thursday. We're going to review tomorrow. We're going to review on Wednesday. And then on Thursday is when you're going to make the document that's going to have which, what's the equation, draw a picture of it. And then you have to make an equation for a problem. And you have number two, you have to make an equation for a ellipse. And number three is a circle or whatever the order may be. Okay. Reach out if you have any questions. I'm here. I miss you guys. Most importantly, I miss you guys. And I hope that, um, that you're, that you're doing fine. You know, get outside, FaceTime your friends, um, talk to your friends on the phone. Like, interaction is good, not just texting. You can't just text all day long. This is my son. Logan, come here. He's playing Roblox. He likes this game called Roblox. So anyways, I'll finish the video. But have, have a good day and have a good week. And then I will talk to you soon. Bye.